Hey guys, welcome back to the Red Dead 2 videos channel. My name is Dean and today I am bringing you guys a really cool audio tool video and this video is a bit different to some of the other videos I make on the channel. So if you guys have been around for the last couple of days, you will know Black Ops 4 has now been officially announced by Triarch. So this means a new Call of Duty game will be coming out later this year. We all know Call of Duty produce a game pretty much every year, but each year it is a different developer. Now this time around it is Triarch's turn to produce a Call of Duty game and that is Black Ops 4. Now normally every year the Call of Duty game releases somewhere around the 11th of November. However this time around Call of Duty Black Ops 4 will be releasing on the 12th of October. The developers of the Call of Duty series never actually release a COD game in the month of October. It's normally in November and it is very very strange considering Considering Red Dead Redemption 2 is releasing on the 26th of October. Could this mean Triarch are trying to live up Black Ops 4 to Red Dead Redemption 2? Or are they feared that Red Dead Redemption 2 will dominate pretty much this year? And in my opinion, yes, I think Rockstar will do well in terms of sales for Red Dead Redemption 2. It is the most anticipated game so far, in my opinion, for... Um, this year anyways. With that said, Call of Duty typically sells millions of copies around each year and that is just because of the name, the Call of Duty franchise. It's pretty much a given for anyone who is a fan of the series. It's just a typical uh, pretty much game you would buy each year. Over time that changed as they have produced many Call of Duty games in the past that didn't exactly do well and I can name a few. Advanced Warfare, Infinite Warfare, Ghosts, I was a huge fan of Call of Duty back around Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, not to mention Call of Duty 4. Ever since then I haven't really been a big fan of any of the other COD games, pretty much except for Black Ops 3. I think Black Ops 3 was pretty good, also Black Ops 1 and Black Ops 2. And I think the Black Ops series done very very well, they were successful. The other Call of Duty games weren't really successful in any way in terms of I guess the, the sales and popularity of the game. Yeah, so it is a bit strange how Triarch now are releasing Call of Duty Black Ops 4 on the 12th of October. So in other words, they are looking to, I guess, I don't want to say compete with Rockstar because I really can't see Black Ops 4 doing anything over Red Dead Redemption 2. I mean, as a fan of both Red Dead Redemption 2 and also the Black Ops series, the Black Ops series, in my opinion, has nothing on Red Dead Redemption. I really don't understand the logic behind releasing Call of Duty Black Ops 4 on the 12th of October. Now, with that said, they probably want to do this because they know if they release it in November sometime, then of course Red Dead Redemption 2 will already be out there in the market, and a lot of gamers will be playing that game. Maybe Triarch wants Black Ops 4 to be ready for the 12th, so that they can actually get first grabs from the market, and to kind of steal the attention away from Red Dead Redemption 2, but that's not gonna happen, I don't think anyways, and I hope for the sake of Red Dead Redemption 2, the game will be awesome. But guys, what do you guys think of that anyways? What do you guys make of Triarch and Call of Duty Black Ops 4 releasing on the 12th of October? If you were an average fan of the COD series, how strange do you guys think this is? So that is really the only logical solution, I can see why they want to get the game out early as possible, but you know, that's just me. Anyways guys, I thank you for watching this video, if you enjoyed, a like rating would be much appreciated and if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe to stay updated with all of the latest Red Dead Redemption 2 videos and much more here on the channel. As always guys, have an awesome day.